Hello, my name is Dustin Luzier with Gaming and Entertainment Touch Technologies in Las Vegas, Nevada. We're going to show you how to properly disassemble and reassemble the non-edge lit IGT dynamic button. What we're going to do is grab our button, flip it over to the back, use our flathead screwdriver and push down on all four corners. Hearing a click, there we go, showing the tabs there. And then on each side, pushing the lens. Doing as gentle as possible. There we go. Slides right out. So you can clean that out. There we have the, uh, the bezel and the PCB. Push that out if you want. Okay, and then we're going to take out the lens and the screen, pulling up gently, hearing a click, all four corners there, there we go, nice and easy. And now we're going to put it back together. So after we've cleaned it, we're going to take the bezel again, put the spring in the bezel, and then put our actuator on top. Placing the lens with the interconnect already connected, being very gentle, pressing on the outside. Yep. Just like that, hearing a click, and then picking up the PCB and connecting it with the interconnect there. There we go. And now putting our lens back on. Bam. So you can find non-edge lit and edge lit IGT dynamic buttons on our GET website, refurbished and brand new.